Okay, these are the Skywalker 1900 millimeter wings. And I've already got the servos installed. Some high tech servos. One thing I noticed right away when I put the uh, carbon fiber into the slot is the carbon fiber goes all the way up until about two inches shy on each side of the actual channel. That's exactly two inches shy. So what I did was I took a quarter inch dowel, piece of wood, I wrapped tape. It's, it's a little bit small. It's not wide enough to fit inside the tube. And so what I did was I used, I just took one end of it and I wrapped electrical tape around it. I made it look a lot better than that. I wrapped it around about three times, just one width of it at the end. And then once I got that on there, I poked it in there, probably about that far, inch, maybe two inches. I shoved it in there and then I glued, ran some CA in there after it was centered, run pretty straight, I put some CA in there. I cut it off at three inches instead of two because it was, it was we're two inches shy right here. But I cut it off at three, put a point on it, and then inside the, the um, channel there, I used the drill bit to, to make a hole. Uh, use whatever you want. Maybe kind of melt a hole into it, maybe a hot exacto knife, I don't know. But anyway, make an inch hole. So what happens is now, this shoves in there on that side, and this shoves in here on this side, same thing, see, shove it right in there, and then when the two halves come together, the center, you've got, well, an extra three inches of reinforcement at least, and which doesn't add too much weight. What I'm going to do is I've got these channels here, what I did is I, I made it so my servo wire ends up just right here, that way all i got to do is plug this in, and then lock this down, I'm going to glue it on there. Permanently, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna try to make it so my so my carbon fiber tubes. I can pull it out because I want to be able to break the swing down. But basically, you can do it however you want. Here's a look at the other side. I just use hot glue every six, three inches or so. Every four inches, I tacked it down, just like normal. Just to tack it down to keep it together. I had to splice some servo wires there to make it long enough. So basically, I got this lead coming out, which I'll be able to connect to the plane, and this shorter extension, which when I glue this in, I'll just be able to, bam, lock it in there just like that, and it should be nice and flush and nice and neat looking.